So given two matrices B and B prime, we need to find the transition matrix from B to B prime. Uh, to do so, we will write it down as B prime, B prime B matrix. So this equals zero, negative two, one, two, one, 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 oh, one, and here we have uh, one, negative one, two, 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 four, and seven, oh, oh. Well, now let's reduce it to echelon's form. So first we will interchange the first row and the second row. So we interchange the first row and the second row and we get that V prime B equals two, one, one, two, two, four, zero, negative two, one, one negative one two one zero one seven zero zero our next step is to multiply the first row by one over two so row one we multiply it by one over two and we get that b prime b equals uh, 1, 1 over 2, 1 over 2, 1, 1, 2, 0, negative 2, 1, 1, negative 1, 2, oh, 1, 7, oh, oh. Okay, next step is, uh, um, is uh, we add negative 1 times the first row to the third row. So the third row is now row 3 minus uh, row 1 so it will look like this b prime b equals 1 oh, oh, 1 over 2 1 over 2 1 1 2 negative 2 1 1 negative 1 2 negative 1 over 2 1 over 2 6 negative 1 negative 2 Okay, now we multiply the second row by negative 1 over 2. So we multiply row 2 by negative 1 over 2. And we get that, okay, I'll just copy paste it and then change the second row. So instead of the second row, we have, here we have 1, here we have negative 1 over 2. Here we have negative 1 over 2. Here we have just 1 over 2 and here we have negative 1. Great, our next step is uh, adding uh, 1 over 2 times the second row to the third row. So R3 equals um, R3 plus 1 over 2 R2. So again, I'll just uh, copy paste it and then change the third row so now in the third row we will have 0 0 1 over 4 23 over 4 negative 3 over 4 and negative 5 over 4 So now we multiply the third row by 4 and add uh, 1 over 2 times the third row to the second row. So first we multiply the third row by 4 and then we, uh, to this, for the second row, we uh, add 1 over 2 R3. Oh, sorry, here we have R3 the third row so we get again i'll just copy paste it since we multiply the third row by three we will have one twenty three my negative three negative five here and now we 
add half of this to the second row so here we will have um, zero here we will have 11 here we will have negative 1 negative 1 and 6 well now we add negative 1 over 2 times the third row to the first row so r1 equals r1 minus 1 over 2 r3 again i'll just copy paste it so r1 equals here we get 0 0 wait no 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 here we have 1 over 2 still here we have 0 then here we have negative 21 over 2 5 over 2 and 7 now we add now we add negative 1 over 2 of the times uh, times the second row to the first row so now we will have 0 right here and here we get negative 16 negative 16 3 10 well so our transition matrix finally we have we have gotten to it this is our transition matrix so we can write down that the transition matrix is negative 16 3 10 11 negative 1 6 23 negative 3 negative 5 